Hello. Greetings. The old dinner. Sorry for running a smidge. Uh, I was stuck in a uh, not stuck in. It was a very fun one, but I was in a game with uh, Bethren and Hunter. We uh, we ended up uh, bullying two newer players, uh, followed by getting stalked by two uh, more experienced players. It was good times. You're sorted by PayPal. Why? What do they say? The Battle of Sigval, uh, five oh seven. Is that the latest one? Yeah. Oh, did I do all the squad E stuff? I must have done already. Did we finish that? No, we didn't. We didn't finish this. Okay. I'll explain our mission. That's really weird. It might be a phone gun. Oh shit, it's not welcome. I need two sets, guys, and I'll um, just gonna put my heating back on. So I've had an awful day, but I'm freezing to death now, so be a sec. Lewd. Oh, good lord. Hey, Colin. Hey, everybody. Yeah, I know their support's not great at times, is it? I've had to phone them once and they got really fucking snippy at me. Imperial forces launched a large-scale attack on the surrounding areas of the city. Oh, no. Seems like a unit split off in the main group and they're doubling around to engage us on two fronts. Squad E holds off the main force. We'll take a detachment approaching from the side. We we'll need to drive off any enemies that made it into the city and break their foothold by taking their camps. Squad E will need our backup and fast. Once you've taken the camp, immediately go to the rendezvous. Alright. Capture all enemy camps or full turn to pass. Alright. Right then. Oh, we've actually don't... We're literally just... The captains... We got the captains of one squad and I guess the captains of the other? Oh no, we've, ch we've just got... We've just got the OGs. We've just got the OGs. Okay. We need to route the Imperial forces as quickly as possible. Hey, Noble. Squad 7, move out! Hey, Varya. We're doing the DLC. Squad E will hold off the enemy's main force while we take out any soldiers that made it into the city. Squad E's badly outnumbered. We need to finish our fight quickly so we can go help them out. Roger that. Let's show them what we're made of. Is that... No, it isn't Welkin. No, it's a different guy. Damn it, bastards think they can waltz right in. Let's kick them out of Galia. The only one who's the original is Alicia. Please, Squad E. Just hold out until we get there. Yeah, it's uh, Patrick Sets. Yeah, so it's not log anymore. Alright, so we've got to capture the enemy camp. All, all the enemy camps, right? Ready to go. Alright, let's have a look. Hostiles confirmed. Be careful. Hostiles confirmed. Be careful. Incoming! Commencing counterattack. Yeah, sucks for you, bro. Yeesh! Oh yeah, it's Sarah as well, yeah. This mission gave you trouble. Well, this one in particular. Okay. Let's have a let's have a look what we got then. We got light, two light tanks here, so we'd have to come around this way, maybe. Interesting. I'm on it. I actually don't know the best way to approach this one. 
We could actually just let the enemy run at us initially. Oh, I was hoping that would destroy it. Maybe not. Oh, that sucks, man. It is it's always it's always sucks to like hurt animals when you don't mean to. It's just not very nice, is it? I'm on it. I think we can sneak around here. Like, yeah. Oh dear god, I've made an error in judgment. We have we have goofed! Go the goofing has commenced I might have to this might be a restart job here. Actually, I have a plan. Got a present for ya. Just speed. Yeah! That didn't work. That didn't work at all. Tears we cry our echoes. <laughs> We'd actually lose there. Uh, yeah. So that's the restart the mission there. I didn't think there'd be two of them. Damn, that's brutal. Alright. Alright, let's go. That was, oh, that was surprising. I was like, good lord. It's the four tournament that got you. Yeah, four tournament is quite tight, actually. Four tournament is quite tight. Um, I still think potentially idle vice. The other option is vice. He goes this way, and we and we actually do this instead, avoiding this section entirely. <laughs> that might be a more sensible choice. Because they can't they can't actually approach this way if we ignore that. So. So if I have enough, like, just about... Yeah, there we go. That's what we wanted. And then... Holy crap, the other device is lousy! Lousy, lousy, lousy. Alright. Hey, Froggy! Interesting. Ragnite tanks. So this would be the only one that's needed to actually murder. Interesting. The scoot, they've got like no HP. I could probably attempt, attempt to go for a double kill if we're being sneaky. One person can take out this tank. Which is an interesting one as well. But to actually do that could be quite tricky. I'm probably just gonna do this. Like that. That should protect us from that side. It's unlike he is unlikely he'll get out there. I think we aim like this. I think we should be okay. These guys probably can't come through here, that's my guess. It's tough being popular. Hey Morgan. Right, there, we could easily kill two. The enemy's returning fire! Got a present for ya! Perfect, double kill. That's what we wanted. Did you really not see this coming? Pretty good. Alright. So what we can do now then is I could leave Rosie here and bring Alicia. Moving out. Now the question is, will they destroy this basic fence? And try and capture my base. Because if they do, that could be a problem. Gotta focus. I see. When you grab a crown, the person who grabs it leaves. Interesting, okay. Well, in that case, I'll do this with Alicia for now, then. Or will I? Actually, maybe I'll do this with Rosie. There's no reason to grab it on first turn anyway. So what we want then is... Largo... I could potentially take Largo here. I've been waiting here. Hey Logan. So Largo's gonna be an interesting one because it will take us multiple turns to get anywhere with Largo. But the question is, is there more tanks down south? Possibly. We could avoid them, I guess. Give it to me. I'm never getting used to this.
You try and snib a guy? Very unlikely. More likely to get that out. Snipping one of these dudes would be incredibly useful. This doesn't matter as such, because I think it, I think it will come out. And if it doesn't, we can always run around the back anyway with Largo. Who have we got here? Now, charge! We want Alicia for the last one, so we probably want Rosie to do this one. Or Rosie to do that one. Lager to do this one. I guess. Ah! Let's try that. Yeah, this is DLC mode of DLC. Now the question is, can they break through that fence? If they can, we might have a problem. That doesn't matter. Oh shit, they did a double fire. We actually might be fucked. Ooh, that's really bad. We might be toast. If they do another double fire, that might be GG. Ooh! Just squeaked that one, didn't we? Alright. Spiky. Not even close, man. I didn't even break a sweat. Right, I'm gonna make a quick save here then. Uh, let's see, book mode, book mode, book mode. Oh, no. Okay. This could be interesting. So first of all, we need to get rid of this tank with Largo. Leave it to me. I should be able to use Largo to tank some of this. Tank, tank, huh? <laughs> tank some of this damage. Lal. Oh, I didn't even shoot. All right, fuck it. Don't bin me. Why are you even saying this to give my ground cut some because they shouldn't need it, in theory. There we go. That'll show them. Now I just gotta get to squad e. Hope they're holding out. They'll be fine. Also, hello everyone. Sorry if I have not said hello. Why don't you come in? Everyone's alright. Right. right, we can use Alicia to kill both these guys. Nice and easy. Moving out. Alicia's gonna be our MVP for the rest of the match, probably. I just need to be a bit careful now. So I need to grenade these two. I need to grenade these two, probably. Get them out of cover. The grenade itself won't do much damage, but it gets the cover destroyed. There we go. So where do we want to go? I take it we can't go this way? That looks like a no. Oh shit. Oh shit, that's actually really bad. Uh, interesting. Look. They are. Keep that's interesting. The only way in is through with the tank. Ah, spicy. Okay. Now that's tricky, isn't it? Well, technically not. I could grenade. Okay, I got a new plan. I need to decide differently. I need to decide differently. Uh, okay, let's have a think. This is gonna be an interesting one. Hello, pumpkin. Yours. Fail me now. Okay, so the eye device is basically wrecked. Alicia should be able to get around there. I don't know how many units are here. Probably a couple at least. Depending on what's here. Leave it to me. Depends on how many points I need to get through. Villain chilling. I like it. Right. It's a shame we have to like use, utilize Ro lose Rosie this time. Actually. 
Yeah. This is gonna be a weird one because if I leave any lancers alive, that's GG for the other boys. So I have to kill, either make it this turn or kill three lancers this turn. I actually don't have to capture this at all. I, it, this is actually not necessary this turn. Wonderful. <sighs> okay. I can make it next turn. I don't know what's there. So that's one and two. Okay. My turn? okay. We can potentially make this. Commencing counter attack. Follow my lead. I have to kill the scoop. I can't kill the scoop. Oh, Alicia, you fucking suck in this game. Jesus Christ. I messed up bad. What the fuck? There's a Gatling turret? Holy shit. How are we supposed to deal with that? Uh, what the fuck? What are we going to do there? Uh. The other option is to do my original plan, which is kill one, two, three. Next turn. Four. Well, ignore that. That. Go through. Ugh, that's not great, though. I guess we could do that. That's not, that's not ideal. That's a toughie. That's a toughie. Hey, Jag. Ooh, wee. Okay. This is gonna be a weird one. In which case, it might be more important this turn Fail me now. to try and kill one of these two. Kill one of these two dudes. Amazing! It's like a treasure trove of samples. Hostiles confirmed. Be careful. Oh no, I pushed the wrong button. Fuck. Sorry. Would you believe me? And this this is really rough, but X in this game is end turn. X in the other game is swap weapons. It's gonna do my fucking Sweden. I'm gonna do that a lot probably. Enemy sight. Alright. Let's kill this guy then. Getting the first two counts. To be fair, I'm rushing this a little bit. I probably, I probably actually should use all four turns to do this. Realistically, I'm, I'm, being, I'm being a bit too zoomy. I'm being a bit too zoomy. Whereas I think we, you know, we can do this with a bit of, a bit more finesse. Probably. All right. So we just squish these guys. Hostiles confirmed. Be careful. Aim for the enemy's flank. Amazing. It's like a treasure. It's a doddle to kill these guys. They but... got you in their sight. Hello, are you? Now. Cool. Target destroyed. Good work. I want the idle vice. Uh, you know, just—it's just one of those things, you know. Just we, we, i don't know what happened to the idle vice. That was really weird. Yeah, we need Carl. Carl was a good man. Right. Do not get sulky. Do not get sulky. Do not get sulky. Do not get sulky. Good. Doing good. They're good. I use Alicia to take these two out. My turn. Okay. My yeah, basically there was three, there was two lancers and a tank, and the lancers were getting friendly, you know, double fire. They were getting like the double fire, which is, which is rough. And 
So what we can do now is spend two turns. I don't know if I need to kill the one behind me. That's it. That's kind of interesting. I don't, I'll park here. There we go. In theory, they'll summon a scout or a shock trooper, in which case it won't matter. I'm going to save this point for next turn. You get closer, bro. Oh yeah, Carl he depots into space, isn't he? No. <laughs> Rude. Fuck him up, Alicia. Right, this is an interesting one. I'm gonna make a, I'm gonna make another save quickly, but I think we can do this in three turns. So, that's book mode, command mode. We can do. Okay, this is gonna be a fun one. So, Idle Vice has 75 HP. So the lance is a problem. We do this. Oh yeah, Carl. Yeah, Carl was our engineer. Carl was our engineer. He was a good lad. Sorry, I missed your question. Uh -oh. The firing back. Top fucking lol eat shit. Empire scumbags. Please. There we go. Three turns. Oh, Not too bad. Not too bad. I've still got to move Rosie, I think, as well. But okay, that should do it. Welcome. I'll go back up squad E. Got it. How about a serenade of bullets? Yeah, you tell him, Rosie. Charging in is what I do. There we go. Stay alert. Inattention cost flies. You're right, Avaria. That was quite tricky. That's pretty much action rationale went for me. Uh, you kind of have to, like, sort of... I there was a lot of units hiding. Dark hair space. This is interesting because I'd say this is a harder, harder mission than the others you've probably done up to this point in the game. I think. That's all the enemy camps. All right, let's move to support Squad E. All right. <sighs> they just keep coming. Gross. There's way too many of them. At this rate, they're bound to break through eventually. Just a little longer. Everyone, we need to hold out. Squad 7's coming to back us up. We'll be here any moment now. Damn it. I don't need those newbies to back me up. I'm a ranger. You hear me, imps? Right. Here we go. So we're on the other side of the map now. Oh, I guess uh, squad... I'm guessing squad 7 will be down here then to capture this camp, I suppose. Alright, let's re- we might as well make another save here then. Okay. Uh... Right. Advancing! Alright, let's use half and see what we got. Do this. There they are. Enemy sighted! Alright, they got a mortar, which can slow us down. Alright, what we got here? Shock trooper, scout, shock trooper, tank, tank. Alright, well. Right there. Is this the right version down. of the game with the obnoxious gimmicky mega tank? No, you're thinking of the first game. You're thinking of the first game. Advancing. 
Hey, Vostro, dude. They call this advanced maneuvers with tanks. Because obviously, if I hit that pole, I'd cry. This looks kind of cheesy. What? How is this cheesy? This is a fucking efficient, is what this is. Alright. Moving out. Target confirmed. Try paying attention. Didn't take much. Well done! Lol, 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 eat shit. Right. Terms. Hello, hello. They can't come through this way, can they? No. Here I go. We use Riley here and position her and just murder some fools. If we position her like here ish. Beep, beep. Here comes the Riley train. Woo woo! Scoot, shock trooper, shock trooper, shock trooper. Gren grenadier. I'll probably take the grenadier out. It's a bit more obnoxious than anything else. Take this! Blammo! Fucking love grenades in this game. No! So I think we probably want to protect Riley here. I got this. So I'm gonna take Raz to give Riley some cover. We'd actually do quite a bit of damage to some of the scouts already. Decent. It's not amazing, but... I mean, it's still 50 odd damage from this range, so that's useful. Right, let's see how this goes. This game's a lot of fun to me, by honestly. Daka, 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 daka! This is why you position the tank like this, by the way. The Lancers are going to try desperately to get into position there, and uh, they're going to have a terrible time. <laughs> and then Raz is going to cut this guy down. Rip. Because he thinks he can go for Riley, and I've defensively positioned Raz so he couldn't. Sorry for the holdup. What the? You're kidding. You held off this many enemies with just you guys? Hey, Izzy. Going all right? Doing some brutal murdering? Some war crimes? You know lady, I'm a ranger. Well, not bad for dark hair, I guess. Now you can kick back and leave the rest to us. Ha, <laughs> please. Like I'd let you hog all the glory, Ginger. Just fuck already, guys. Jeez. Squad e. The cavalry's finally here. What do you think? Stalker 1 or Cyberbook? A level up day purchase. When's your birthday, Noble? Uh, depends on what kind of thing you're after. It's today! Oh, Noble, happy birthday, man! Happy birthday to you, dude! Oh, happy birthday, man! Have you had a good day? What's the, what's the, what's the magic number this time? Three cheers for Noble! Hip hip! Hooray! Happy birthday, man. Oh, if you had to pick between the two, it depends on what you're after, right? Do you fancy that big, that big massive open world sort of style adventure that Cyberbook gives? I think Cyberbook is really fun. It's really fun. But Stalker, Stalker's obviously old, but Stalker's also still fantastic as well. I personally 
just sheerly <laughs> for the narrative funness of the main story quest, I would say get Cyberpunk. I would say get Cyberpunk. But put Stalker in your backlog. And do both. But get Cyberpunk for now. Is what I would say. Oh well, happy birthday to your mum as well. I want to. I do want to play Stalker on stream at some point before the new one comes out as well. Reinforcements. Thanks for showing up. Don't worry about it. Without you guys, we'd never have cornered the ones in the city. Now I figure it's time we return the favor. Let's wake these imps up. Yeah, fuck them. Sorry for the wait, Alicia. You're here. Of course, I'd never leave a friend behind. Woohoo! Come on, let's do this. Is the eye device still in one piece? Oh, ugh, cough, cough, Sorry splutter, splutter. Wait. Squad Seven is ready to support. Welcome. Am I glad to see you? Now everyone's here. We're unstoppable. This is a fight to protect Galia. Everyone, cooperate with Squad Seven and take out the enemy. Let's end this. And the other the road. How much HP have we got? Ah, oh, free heal, baby. Yes! Alright, so Rosie's up here. Largo's over here. Oh, this is gonna be... Well, I mean, they're all fucking dead, yo. We'll just use Rosie and take the base quickly. It's tough being popular. Brap! Look me in the eye. Did you really not see this coming? He literally didn't. He literally didn't, Rosie. He, he was... He couldn't, in fact, see that coming because we shot him from behind. Nice one, Noble. When you do play, have to let me know how you uh, get on with it. Potentially, let's just take Rosie around here and just finish this. Oh boy. Okay. Come on. That's cool. We can make that work. Then. They're nice and close now. All right. Uh. It's tough being popular. I think we can probably get around to it. Target sighted. They're in range. Damn. Holy this shit. Isn't right. He's all shock troopers. Got a present for ya. Got a present for ya. I can probably make this work, but it's gonna be a bit whiffy. Oh, the other option is we can do something funnier. Oh, we can absolutely do something funnier. Working about here. Beep! Beep! It's the Riley bomb. It's the Riley bomb. <laughs> Too easy. Fucking rip. One more for me. Can I do this in one turn? Two more points. No, I can't. I can't do this in one turn. What a fucking target do. Oh, I, I think I wasted the go by using Alicia here. That's a bit of a shame. We can still make this work though. So I need to capture. I'm on it. Go down. Grenadiers are great, yeah. They're a really nice addition. Real nice addition. Alright, so we're gonna take one more turn, which might get us the B rather than the A, but we'll see. So that's this sorted, and then we take uh because the problem is I can't kill this guy. I could kill this guy with Alicia, but I think the Gatlin turret, unfortunately, Stay cool. um, is the problem. Engaging. I'm not sure if this will kill him. Now. 
Summon reinforcements, I fucking dare you. Let's go. Hopefully I'll get an A for five. Mm. That's quite brave. I respect that. <laughs> Who should we get a kill with? Landing a mortar and radio. Yes, it's great when you do that, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, essentially, eventually, the um, the grenadiers replace the lancers, really, in every way. Everyone's okay, right? <sighs> Thank goodness. I gotta hand it to you. I'm not used to seeing one squad hold off a force like. Yeah, you are. We did that all the time in the first game. We shout about Rosie. Yeah. Well, you guys don't fight like newbies. I'll be honest. I didn't expect you to keep up with us. That was amazing. We yeah, it's a shame that the OG voice actors aren't all there. Been fighting together for years. Is our Asara and um, uh, Alicia are back there at least? Tactics based off of every soldier's experience. That battle taught me more than any military training did. I think we learned a lot from you guys too. Now, Kif. I'm really glad we came here. Right. And thank you, Squad Seven. Okay. I'm oh, really? Asara is too. She sounds really close though. We better get back to base. Hey. Yeah. Nice. Welcome, soldiers of Squad 7. There was some performance out there. I'm gonna drink a sec, folks. BRB. Gonna brave the cold in the kitchen. Lewd. Oh. Like, I don't think Rosie is like 100% one to one, but I think the lady um, gets Rosie's accent back really well. Which is impressive. Like, the, the accent's very, very similar. Well, we learned a lot ourselves. We finally got to see you, Rangers, in action. Wait, there's a donation. Shit, miles away. Fuck. Sorry. I say fuck. That's like the wrong word. I mean, thank you. <laughs> that's, a, that's a better word. Let me just have a look. Sorry. Both of Zoltan's nipples. Please accept this humble thank you for being such grand folks. Well, that's very cut. Well, thank you. Like, I really hope you have a wonderful birthday. I really, really do. And I'm, you know, honestly, it's always a pleasure to have you here. Thank you very, very much. That's extremely kind. I will put that towards the uh, death space I've picked up for uh, Friday. Thank you very, very much. You are very, very kind. And I really, really hope you enjoy Cyberpunk. I I, I thoroughly fucking loved it. I, I I, mean, I do still love it. I really enjoyed it, even even when it was, quote, you know, really bad. Like, quote, like, I really enjoyed it. I hope you do too. Thank you very much. Very, very lovely and generous of you. It's a shame our training was interrupted, but I think that battle taught us a lot more than exercises did. I'd say we're the ones who Largo's pretty close, yeah. Oh, you actually think Largo sounds the least? I actually think Largo's not too bad, but it is, but it's still Patrick sets, and it sounds like him, you know? I saw that city after the battle. Honestly, it kind of shocked me. Patrick sets always reminds me of Jameson Price, like a similar sort of uh, Barely any style. Collateral damage. The roads, the buildings, you never know the war passed through. Oh. Well, of course. We're fighting to protect Galia, not destroy it. If we 
have to hurt our people or harm our homeland for a victory. It wouldn't be a victory at all. Welkin's the roughest, I think, yeah. I I realize it must It's not even close, like not even a, it's, again, he's obviously no no disrespect to the voice actor. Still doing a good job, just very, very not very similar to what it was. Even if we beat the enemy, it's all pointless if we don't have a home to come back to. So Squad 7 can protect Galia, and Squad E will face the Empire head on. Kind of like that last battle. But I figure it's the same for all of us. We just want this war over and our folks safe. Then you can just sit back and relax. I'm invincible, okay? The Empire doesn't. Is that clip of his hair? Disgusting. <laughs> Must be nice being a fearless idiot. You can be as confident as you want. Just make sure you don't get yourself killed out there, okay? And you really gotta watch what you say, lady, or you might catch some friendly fire. Hey. Right. Mm -hmm. Gotta watch out for guys like you chasing the, uh, what was it? The junk in my trunk? What? No, hey, I wasn't... Lady, I wouldn't hit on you if you paid me. Oh, where'd that come from? I figured you were beyond being self-conscious about your dirty mind. You're a lot more feisty than I expected, too. Guess that explains why this guy is such a pushover. Hey, I am not! Yeah, <laughs> eat shit, Russ. <laughs> well, they're still arguing, but at least it sounds a little more friendly. Claude, His Excellency wants to speak with you. Fucking Claude. Ambassador Townsend? Okay, I'll be right there. Come on, Claude. Ah, Lieutenant Wallace. Fine work out there. Your swift response does you credit. Where are your eyebrows? Your Excellency. I'm just glad I could help. Well, if you wouldn't mind, there's something I'd like to discuss with you in private. Is that all right? It involves kidnapping a certain princess. Concerning? Let me be candid. There is a certain personal endeavor I would appreciate Squad E's assistance with, rather than return to the front line. I will have you head to Rangri's for the sake of oh. a special mission. To kidnap a princess? Rangri's. The mission itself is nothing terribly difficult, but you should know that failure is not an option. Yeah, he's got a big four, doesn't he? <clears throat> Claude's like... Rest assured, once we resolve this delicate matter, I will personally ensure you have a... I mean, we know that Squad E wasn't there, because, uh, you know, we, we <laughs> killed them all. I'm sorry, sir, but we have allies waiting for our return to the front lines. If we stay any longer, I'm afraid it may have serious consequences for the operation, and for our allies. I can't endanger them on a promise of future glory, sir. We need tangible victories, ones we can fight for. We need to catch our train, sir. I'll pretend this conversation never happened. I see. That's a shame, Lieutenant Wallace. A terrible shame indeed. Ambassador Townsend. It's been a pleasure. You literally gave him the eat shit response. Good for you, Woke. Oh, not Woken. Good for you, uh, Claude. Has Alicia recovered? What, from the tank okay. shell to the forehead? Everyone's ready. Ah, she's we fine. Get moving. Oh, wait. I've got some souvenirs for Squad E. It's Rosie's underpants. It, is that more of your homemade bread? I thought I'd never have any again. She's fine, yeah. From the friend fire. Rip. I just baked it, so it should stay soft for a while. <laughs> Maybe you'll <laughs> have it for lunch on the train. But The most important part of baking is passion for your work. Alicia, you're going to be an amazing baker. To be fair, fresh bread is amazing. When you open your bakery, Don't you bin have me. to put ads in the papers, okay? I promise I'll find you. Somehow. Wow. Um, okay. It's a promise. Um, Riley? Thank you so much for teaching me about your technology. I thought maybe you could find some way to use this, so... Schematics? Is this for a smoke bomb? Smoke bomb. Smoke bomb. amazing, Isara. Did you come up with this yourself? Marmite's amazing. Don't... No fucking sass. It's still just a prototype. Can't get enough range on the smoke to make it useful in combat. But it's so close. All you need to do is fine tune it a little. 
See, if you modify the exhaust valve's shape... The exhaust valve? Oh, of course! Riley helps, uh, with the thought smoke thought bomb. That. Yay! See? Perfect! I'm sure we can make I'm not quite sure when this is supposed to be. Avarice, this might be slightly further in the main um, mission. Isara? Yes? It's before I, a certain uh, event, I know that. I was just thinking, once the war's over... Maybe we could meet up and, um, talk to She's about 15. Us. Sorry, I just thought we'd, uh... Of course. Careful out there, Mr. Invincible. Get rid of you perv. I don't want to see you sniffing around my doorstep again. You hear me? Sad listen, dude. <laughs> you can't keep me out. Golly is my home, and I'll be back before you know it. Well, I'm not great at goodbyes. It's time to go. Makes me wish we'd met under different circumstances. I think we would have been good friends. What's that supposed to mean? We are friends, aren't we? The power of friendship! Yay! I know I'm not gonna forget our time together. Or Alicia's bread, for that matter. You don't talk about Alicia's bread! Psh! <laughs> Slap some more pow! <laughs> It'd be hard to forget you going back for a fifth helping. <laughs> oh, really? Welcome, and everyone in Squad 7. Hey, this is like... Thank you for sharing your courage with us. That's the same, Riley. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. Three days of Dead Space. Yeah, I'm going to be streaming it Friday. I'm going to be streaming it Friday. Very much looking forward to it. We'll protect Galia, we promise. So, Claude? Claude. Go end this war. Claude with a K. And mortal Claude bat. That looks like hand-holding to me. I promise. Hand-holding? Illegal! Over. Meet you back in Galia. Yeah, it's a promise. They're wearing gloves. Is that okay then? The gloves make it okay. Well, Squad E, it's time to head to the front lines. It's okay. They're safe. They're wearing the hand condoms. Lude. I was just getting Lude. to know them. And now we have to head back. <laughs> Beat to it, Noble. <laughs> But we've got a job to do. Still, it'll be fine. And Kane. And we'll see each other again. You seem like good people, right, Claude? Claude. Whoa, Raz is praising another squad? Did you hit your head out hey, there? Hey, Yeah, yeah, laugh it up. Man, I get no respect. No respect, I'll tell you. I think Ali is safe with them. But we gotta get back here after all this. All of us. We're all coming back. Soon enough, we'll be breaking bread again. There we go. That's the OC. Or not? Listen up, everyone. I'd like to introduce a new member of Squad E. I thought that was it. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh no, it's like a, well, there's a special Duncan. mission because we got the A ranks. As a tank driver. There's a special rank. Hopefully, I don't disappoint you. It's Welkin. Yeah, we get to, we get to have them in our squads now if we want. Alicia Melkiot. Proud member of Squad E. I'll do my best out there. Call me Rosie. And you're picking me, huh? Good call, Hotshot. Name's Largo. I'm a Lancer. Just point me at a tank, and I'll get it out of your way. There we go. I actually forgot, this is like a little uh, side mission. I will do this one later, though. I'll do this one later. So, uh, we're gonna go back to the main chapter. And carry on for now. No, Alicia does not do the thing. Alicia in this game is garbage. Garbage. The Federation Vanguard pushed deep into Imperial territory. Slowly but surely, the Empire was driven back. Jameson but and Bryce. On the, defensive, the Eastern forces proved formidable opponents. Dad near, a fine lad. While, That's Dad near, yeah. Ways to hinder their enemy's advance. Damn advice, you're a book. Using counterattacks and scorched earth tactics, the Empire brought the Federation to a halt, even as they retreated. You can't die, Kaine. We're friends now. And at the same time, they had concentrated their reinforcements at the Ziegfall Line. Their wall of iron stood tall and the legions behind it were ready and waiting to strike. 
Jameson Price in loads of games. He's in Tales of the Abyss as well. That's one of the one of the big bad guys in that as well. Between the Federation and Imperial armies. He is in a lot of games actually. Yeah. He's always really good. As the Battle of Siegfried. Yeah, he's Sejiro as well. Yeah. Meep meep. Listen up, everyone. I'd like to introduce a new member of Squad E. Dan Bentley. I'm not what you'd call a social butterfly, but uh, good being on your team. Dan is fucking awesome, by the way. Dan gets us our APC. The APC is really good. I haven't seen that tank around. The cactus. Wait, it's an APC? Who the hell do they think they are? Just cruising into our squad's camp. Yeah, 9S is in the log games, yeah. Kira Buckland's in the fair few as well. Is the squad E barracks? And what if it is, Scruffy? Who's asking? Whoop, sorry. The name's Dan Bentley. I've been assigned here from the 31st Battalion. We get reinforcements. Well, that means. Yep. There's a big up coming down the pipes. That's the higher. It's pretty hardcore facial there, isn't it? Your vehicle's an APC, right? Yeah. Stick a couple of soldiers in this baby, and they'll get to the front lines without a scratch. Huh. Well, beats getting shot at. After you get out, that's your business. But speaking personally, I'd rather get everyone back. Facial hair, yeah, literally, man, right? Well, I've been driving for two days straight, so if you folks don't mind, I'm gonna get some shut eye. That was pretty quick. Yeah, the cactus is great. It's literally what it says. It's a, it's a, a it's a, uh, a mini tank that we can drive very, very quickly, very far, and it can shoot and can transport two units in. So slower units are great, or fragile units. We need to move around. So I see. Soldiers, the final battle is upon us. The Empire's built a defensive line along their old border. They I can hear someone from inside the APC. He's loud, man. This is the Zeke Fall Line. And the troops defending it. I can hardly imagine how many soldiers are in that shot. This photograph only shows our target, the central area. That's a lot of, a lot of dudes. The Empire has ten units of this size stationed at regular posts along the line. What? That force alone looks huge. We have ten times that? Oh my. It's true. We've been chipping away at the Empire's numbers. But judging by this, they still have enough soldiers to outclass anything we've dealt with so far. We're low on supplies as it is. And now we have to face an army like that? What chance do we have? It's very interesting, because like, just like in, you know, just like in a real combat, uh, defensive positions are much easier to maintain than the offensive one. Pushing forward into enemy territory is difficult, and defending it is much is much more advantageous. So they've got a they got a big uh, big defense. Yeah, he does look a bit like David. They may have strength in numbers, but every one of our soldiers is worth ten of those conscripted farm boys. Yeah, fuck them. Minerva, you have a bad habit of underestimating the enemy. <sighs> We're facing an iron wall, with all of the Empire's military strength behind it. Not only is the Federation outnumbered, but we're exhausted from a long campaign. Is it really a hopeless fight, though? Think of our battles. Defect like Claude is pretty clever. Every time we snatched victory from the jaws of defeat, who made that possible? The Ranger Corps. Hoorah! Yeah, we did. We can outfight them. We can outsmart them. And above all, we have a home to protect. Also, we we know that the you know we know that we win the war. Like we we know that because we played the first game. <laughs> we eventually win. Ooh. I mean, that's that's obviously not canon though. The Federation can't lose because the Rangers always win. Yeah, fuck the Romulans. Oh wait, no, no, still fuck them. Woo. Lieutenant Wallace is right. Woo. We cleared the way for Operation Northern Cross. If they want to fling insults from behind a wall. 
then we'll stand with pride and face them. Your father was a hamster, and your mother. <laughs> Fuck you. Th yeah. Maybe I can do it. Let's tear it down. We'll break their wall of iron. <laughs> too, man. Kind of glory, I'm doing that. I'm doing that low today. tonight. We're all on the today, same brain length. It's ours to claim. We got we got hive brain on the go. Yeah! I'm sorry. Can we? I, I'm sorry. We only had one take for that. Can you try that again? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Look at them. They're full of fire again. They're really something. <laughs> it's a hair color. She's like, shut up, Babaka Shinji. Minerva. I don't know, Noble. I think it's cooler when you, you know, you can't see. It gives you the more um, anime look. Sorry about earlier. I'm calling you out. I mean. I mean, yeah. To be fair, Claude, that was actually really unprofessional for two commanding officers to do each other in front of the troops. That's not what you should do, really. If you got a problem with a, another commanding officer, you should probably like talk to them. Like, you know. No need to apologize. You gave them something to hold on to. She says as she swiftly kicks him in the balls. Boosh! Do you think it was right to say all that? No, I think you're a fucking plank. It wasn't exactly a lie, but... But this is suicide. No matter how many speeches we gave. So it's not just me. You have to be stupid or insane to believe we can turn this into some storybook victory. Kidney punch. <laughs> Stop when the blood comes out. But we have to try. We certainly can't back down now. The only thing we can do is to try and keep morale up. If we can't push all the way to the capital, Operation Northern Cross is doomed. Doomed! Yeah. We're fighting for our fallen comrades, too. I just wish I'd been stronger. This may be our last battle, and I don't want to go in with regrets. So there's something I have to tell you. You're a piece of shit, and I wouldn't even piss on you if you're on fire. Mm -hmm. I've always hated you, ever since we were at the Academy. Oh, that's pretty close. Always spouting your idealistic bullshit like you've got it all figured out and nobody else gets it. No matter how hard I've worked, Damn. you were always one step ahead, one rank ahead with a fraction of the effort. That's not true. You've always been better than me. Even now. Claude's so taken aback about all the spaghetti coming out of Minerva's pockets that... That's exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> that damn attitude. Ask anyone on this base who the ace of the armed ranger battalion is. You know who they'll all point to? Kai, obviously. Claude Wallace of Squad E. Oh. I would have lost that one then. You need to wake up and take responsibility for that. If anyone's been keeping our momentum up, it's you. And you alone. <laughs> That's all. Stupid Babaka Shinji. <laughs> I didn't want to die without telling you that you're a piece of shit and I hate you. You have a reputation to uphold, Claude Wallace. Get out there and don't disgrace it. Okay. Has anyone else noticed that Minerva's probably got a uniform about two sizes too small? Maybe I could use a little self-awareness. We'll win this fight with our own hands. Is Minerva pissed at the concept of humility? I think she's very competitive. I think, truthfully, she's very competitive. She's also she's also extremely talented in her own right. That's the, that's the thing, like, she she is upset. That's what I think Minerva's quite interesting. She's, like, super upset with Claude, like, in the way his attitude is, but respects him as well. And it's the sort of, I think you're an ass, but I think you're also really good at what you do, and if, you, if you're gonna do this, you better fucking do it right. She doesn't like him personally, because of his attitude, but appreciates him professionally. And that's an interesting sort of place to come from, I think. We will end this war. I kind of think that's, I kind of think that's neat. I like it. I love the Ragnite engines. They, they do look awesome. Like, that big blue. Vroom, vroom. It's cool. Oh man, if these guys had flying machines in this uh, universe at this point that weren't rickety bastards, this would really help them out. 
Minerva's obsessed with comp competition and this, and she can't win. Yeah, here. yeah, pretty much, yeah. He said he forgot something, but that was a while People ago. People like that, I find are dangerous. That's, that's the interesting thing, like, they potentially can overcompensate and make rash decisions to try and prove themselves. Sorry I'm late. Well, this is a surprise. I was texting Asara. I was sending her a letter via Albatross. Hey, give him a break. If he wants a little alone time in his bunk before we head off to battle... <laughs> Raj is like, he's having a crafty wank, mate. Give him a sec. No, that's not what I... Raz, come on. I went to get my camera, but everyone kept asking me to take their picture on the way back. It's hard to get film out here. I wanted to save the last shot for Squad E as a team. Aw. Oh, no. Nice. No dick pics, yeah. Everyone, gather around the tank. Come on, Dan, you too. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta get in here before the suicide. Pass. I don't do pictures. <laughs> Come on, don't be shy. You too, Riley. Uh, me? Of course. Okay, everyone, smile. Three, two, one. And there's our picture. You got my good side, right? I look like hot stuff, don't Rags I? Rags is in the picture. Yay! I don't know, Raz. Camera can only do so much. Doggo. Hey, the hell's that supposed to mean? I think I'm starting to see. Nice like muscles, <laughs> Raz. Yeah, literally, right? What? Hmm. How you've changed. Just for today. I'll trust you. So no more scaredy Claude, all right? Scaredy Claude. <laughs> These missions can be quite brutal, by the way. Squad up is on the move. We should go too, Commander. Okay. Squad E, move out. Rose of two, forward march. You got. Claude. If we beat the imps here. They can't afford to go after Gallia. I love the little, um, I love the little, like, three, like, the one-wheeled truck at the back. What a weird-looking design. I kind of love that, though. Funny-looking things. That's what you said, isn't it? Yes. The fate of Gallia hinges on this battle. Okay, let's kick some Imperial ass. Squatty, we march to the Ziegfall line. Here we go. First mission. So let's quickly save it. Go. Well, let's go to headquarters quickly. Uh, let's. Uh, how much XP have I got? Mm. Is there any ones? On, is there any things worth getting at the mess hall? Oh, Kai. What's up with the bandage? Oh, it's a little souvenir from our last mission. Don't worry. It only grazed me. It's not like you to get hit. You're normally so cautious. It was nothing but a story. Robin relied on military talks and probably about as useful, yeah. You turn too sharp, just falls over. Guess it's just bad luck then. Anything can happen on the battlefield. Yeah, pretty much. Then again, the fact that I'm the one who got hit is probably good luck. I used to like in the new Nier, the remake, uh, Jameson Price is in it for one line. <laughs> it's just really weird, but I, I appreciate that. Why is that? It's easy to get first aid to snipers. We stick to the rear. Bleh. Soldiers on the front lines aren't so fortunate. That's true. If the fighting drags on long enough, even a shallow wound like that could turn fatal. Sorry, T-Sex. Make sure it's not work. Cool. Sorry, I had a bit of a mare of a day. <laughs> Just right. keeping track of things. Wish there was a better way to get urgent care to the front line. Urgent care? Wait, I think I know an order for that. Ugh. It's not really worth it, probably. Not but... bad, Claude. Not bad at all. This will give our troops a lifeline in case of emergencies. I think we need to get some of these earlier ones to get some of the better ones, though. Right. Good to see you again, Claude. To be fair, we did get extra from the DLC anyway. Alright, so I reckon... Just get the these guys up. All right. Just do it. Do it. 
Yeah, she's not as good as Nolan North, that's true. You've leveled up, so to speak. Good work. Yeah, Claude just remembers shit, yeah, but for experience. Have I played Fast Phobia? Yeah, I have, yeah. I feels alright. Played with Anna and uh, Mapes and uh, Peggy. Have found a new potential. Hmm. How about please do it? Exactly. That's not very polite, is it? You're clear to learn a new order. Explosive boost. Nice. <laughs> Done for today? Hey, thank you, Bloodgrass. I will attempt not to, don't worry. Oh. No promises. I think we can do the cactus now, potentially, but... Aha! Accuracy or standard? Uh, I don't actually think there's any need to get accuracy. Standard's oh. better, I want to say. Whoa. I actually need to check some of our guns again, then. A lot of times, if you're careful with the accuracy, you can sort of make it work anyway. Are these now b worse? Are these better or worse than what we've already been using? Six, two, seven. I'll have to check the. Uh... Hey, grenade upgrade! And defense upgrade. There we go. Yeah, it makes a huge difference having this defensive stuff. Right. Cactus! What do you get, Cactus? Reinforced body. Nice. Beep beep. Alright, we can plonk that in. Right, what about half and. Ooh, there we go. Ooh, these are quite expensive. Ooh, I need to be a little bit careful. Yeah, right, Sage. Oh. We can actually fit that in here pretty easily right now. There's no reason not to fill this out. Unlike the uh, idle vice, where we most of the time wouldn't even bother using half of the shit, we are we are going to use this. So. Just do that. Right. Let's check my equipment here because I want to say. Oh no, his is still better, just about. The M91R is actually still better. What about... Is the Wasp... Oh no, the, the one she... Oh, hello. Actually, less range. So there's more... The aim on the Wasp R is better, but it does less damage. Uh, I think that's probably fine. I'm riding to the Heartsman R. Is that better than the Sandu? This got more range, this has more damage. I'm gonna go for the damage ones. Cool. Although, do we actually have. Uh, let's have a look. Plus five aim. That should be better for. I'll give that to Flora. She can. Ghost watches, what's that about, mate? Alright, I think we're ready for the mission. Cool. Sorry, it, it requires a little bit of setup, but I think it was worth it. So. Alright. I think there's three missions solid. to this chapter. There's quite a, quite a few. We just captured the front line here. This is rough. This is just a charge in. Squad E's task is to secure a bridgehead which for, to, break, to break the Sigvold line. But it's not going to be easy. There are pillboxes along a defensive perimeter. So enemy forces are concentrated up front. So as frontal assault will prove difficult. Finding routes around them might be safer, but any path will be dangerous. Use the terrain and tank wreckage as cover. One more thing. Enemy reinforcements are en route from the back line, so get ready. Alright. Consider so deploying an engineer, which we absolutely will. So. We've got Dan. We can actually get Welkin if we want to. We can get Welkin in there as a separate tank, but it's not worth it. We're going to have uh, Dan with the cactus. Okay, so who do we want in here? A 
so what we'll actually do Lock and load. I'm gonna take a couple of peeps up north I wanna say not sure who yet I'll take Nico as well All right, and then we're gonna take we'll have Rebecca. Preparation complete. I'll do what I want. Uh, we'll have Riley. My turn. We'll have Kai. I've got this. Uh, who else should we have here? Might be might be prudent to have one Lancer. I don't know. Should we bring? We've only got one shot true. I'll probably bring a second. Who are we gonna bring? Are we gonna bring Feria, Flore, Emmy, or Viola? Who do you reckon? All are very good. Feria? Always her? Was it because of her amazing helmet? I'll try my hardest. Alright. This is a toughie. We might have to do redo a few times. So we'll see how we go. That is all. Now tear down the iron wall. Yeah, GG, easy, mate. If we want to break the Ziegfeld line, we need to make an opening. Squaddy, move out. So the cactus is gonna be our friend here, at least initially. This is insane. There's imps everywhere you look. Look at how many tanks and pillboxes they have. How do we break through this? Hmm. How indeed. Up in this little thing. Their bullets won't do it. Just let me know where you want me. Glad you're on our side. Give him his orders, Claude. And make sure they're good ones. Yeah, Claude. I will. Okay, let's do this. All right. Pillboxes. Pillboxes are structures that can't move, have high defensive capabilities. Pillboxes can be attacked at the opening at the front or the entrance at the back. Ragnite power generators are often set nearby, so aim for those two. Some pillboxes are hastily built and are covered in a tarp instead of a ceiling. Rude. Grenadiers can take care of roofless pillboxes by hitting them from above. That's new for this game. Here's an order, don't fuck it up, dude. You've got an APC on your side now. You'd better learn how to use it, and fast. Armored personnel carriers can board foot soldiers to carry over the battlefield. Infantry being carried by an APC won't receive damage from an interception fire. Units can be boarded from an APC by either using action mode or command mode. In the action mode, move a foot soldier to the APC and press bloop when it appears. Alternatively, move the APC next to a foot soldier. In command mode, select a foot soldier near the APC and press F. Unload a unit being deployed carried by an APC by pressing F. Keep in mind that APCs are not as well armored as tanks. If an APC is destroyed while carrying units, all the units inside it will be forced to retreat. Yes, yeah, so don't fuck it up. There is a lot of units here, as you can see. So we've got some pillboxes. We've got a Gatling turret. Snoofers. We've got anti-tank cannon. That's a big one. That one needs to be removed. Uh, so those are the ones we've got to be a little bit careful. There's quite a few grenadiers here. Another Gatling turret. Another Gatling bunker. Okay. Right, let's save it before we get going. There's quite a lot here, so. There's a horror tag, it's spooky, man. Gotta watch out for the spooks. Okay, so first things first. I'll show you how uh, good old Dan works. Dan is excellent, because he moves fast, so what we're gonna do. Bonk. Yoink. So, look at this. What a fucking nightmare. Alright. No, I'm out of ammo!
go. Alright, so we got Snoofer, we got the Gatling Tower, which we can use, we can destroy with Raz if we want to. We got rid of one of the bunkers already, which is handy. We're probably going to want Harfen to move up somewhere, but we've got to be careful of those anti-tank cannons. I probably want to get Riley to destroy one, so we want to get reasonably close with Harfen. Okay, okay. moving out. Alright. That Gatling Tower could be a problem. I could destroy this one. Right there. Yeah, there we go. Pretty good. Plot. Anti-tank guns, dead ahead. Looks like a new model. It can shoot at us while we're moving. All vehicles, stay out of its range. Rapid fire anti-tanks. Fire armor-piercing shells. These units are stationary, but can use intercept fire against the tanks. You can't use intercept fire against infantry, save them out of the lands for a shock Hit. Commencing counter attack. Follow my lead. Yeah, I took a bit of damage there. The, I got hit by a mine as well. Okay, so that should be safe for us to approach. Leave it to me. So we can use Riley here to get over here. Let's wipe them out. Hopefully, if we can get Riley into position. That might be far enough. Might not. Let's have a look. Oh yeah. Theory we can. Come on. Yeah, nice. Perfect. Got him. Kill confirmed. There we go. So we've got a couple of shock troopers here and a tank we need to sort of deal with really. So Kai can probably remove some units if we need them. Are they crouched? No. Are they crouched? No. Try not to get killed. That's what we can do here is very quickly. Sword. Just we'll park Rebecca here. It's so we can repair, end up repairing half if we need to. I got this. I'll help you. Come on. Nice. Your own damn fault. It's going okay so far. We just need to be a little bit careful when we're moving forward, but... Well, we're taking a hostile camp. Impressive. Uh, where do we actually want to go? I'm probably going to sit Raz here for now, I think. There's a snoofer up there we can deal with, but... I want to stop anyone potentially coming forward for now. We've got a long way to go and we don't want to push too far too quickly. Godwin could come round and kill this. Let's have a think how we want to do this. Okay, moving out. Now we've removed the uh in range. Enemy side. Oh shit. Wow, that's more of a problem, isn't it? That is way more of a problem. Ooh, lad. Okay. Let's have a think now. Open a path. Let's have a think. What do you want to do here? I got two shots. I could use Riley to take care of both of these, probably. Take this. 
That was a fucking scam. That should have got that. Not really what I wanted to do there, but alright, let's try again. Sure. Come on! Come on! Am I just getting fucking screwed here? Here I go. That should easily hit. Oh, we're gonna get screwed. Okay. Not ideal, but you know. This is gonna be a bit rough. Okay. Don't look at me. This might be a bit dodgy now, but we'll see. How's it looking out there? So there's another one over there, I think. So if I point myself about here... Alright, I think this is going to go horribly wrong. I think we'll have to... I think that screwed us a bit, but we'll see. We're fine. Minimal damage. Yeah, that's fine. I'm going to repair next turn, anyway. Uh-oh. Oh, ah, shit! Oh, that's not too bad, actually. You didn't go for the head. That's really fucking bad. Oh, oh, I was outside of instant fire. That's why I needed that extra like command point. I really needed that extra command point, but we had to use it on Riley twice extra. Cheers, Sage. Catch load up. All right. I think we can probably make this work still, but not ideal. Advancing. Really? Really? Oh, man. That's just unlucky. Can I do this with like losing three points less? Now advancing. That was just bad luck, really. Didn't take much. Target destroyed. Very good. Okay. Just don't get in my way. We're gonna get right. We can get ready back, Captain. Out of my way. Right on. I mean, some of this is trying to work with what you got, right? So we'll see how we see how we get on. Nedic. You're safe now. Hang. We got right, we got right back. Okay. I can't take much more. Not having Riley is gonna actually make this really hard. You can replace all of chests. You can't replace them. This one's gonna be much more of a problem. Uh, I actually, I'm gonna have to reload. I have to reload. Yeah. Fuck. That's really unfortunate. I need, I need Riley. I need Riley there. That's really annoying. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Just got redone. Yep, I'm on it. Hey, Josie, you alright? Mm, nice and cozy in here. Smells like. 
like gunpowder. Move up to me. What? 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 That shouldn't have happened. That didn't happen last time. Did I do something weird last time? So which one was it? That one there? The, the, the pillbox got me? Did I have my engine showing to it? I must have just had my... I must have just been facing it in a really weird way. Advancing. Very bizarre. Fire. Cool. Yeah, I must have just clicked the radiator. I was like, right, we need to watch out for that. Manta tank, and I can't go too far. Probably about here the limit then. As we discovered, with enough accuracy on this, we can... Take this. Nice, get it, we'll go. Yeah, I mean, you can, to be fair, you can replay the story missions in the first game, you just have to beat the game first. That's the sort of thing about that. Right. How are we going to do this? I could use Kai to clean up here and remove some units. How did I do this last time? I used Rebecca to get close and I shoot one of these on the way. And having Rebecca further up is actually kill. useful, so we'll do that anyway. You want me to kiss him and make it better? Rebecca, chill, for fuck's sake. debuff, what, not being able to use Ragnade, it's not great, is it? Um, I don't think I got that pillbox, though. Alright. Right, how are we going to do this, then? I'm pretty sure I use Raz to clear this out and take that as well. Fairy I could easily clear here. Was there one over here that I missed as well? To avoid scummery, and we've done quite a bit already. Whoops, I'm gonna quickly save it here again. 521. Alright. Okay. Let's see. Definitely a third, wasn't it? Because it was one that was harassing Riley. But now I've got the. I can actually take the half and around this way if we want to now, which is a bit safer. Okay, moving out. 
Way too fast, too risky. I mean, killing that scout would actually be kind of useful. I don't think there's a way in hell I can hit him though. We might as well use this for something. What are we gonna do with this? Can essentially blow one of the tanks up anyway. Fire! <clears throat> the guy hiding around the wall, like here, yeah. Shouldn't be too much of a big deal. Alright, I got four points. I actually don't need the APC to. I could get them out of the APC this time. There's no real need. Yeah. Right, I need to use Kai. Let's take to kit that snoofer. So that snoofer's a command point snoofer, so we want him dead. Mm. Nice. It's going pretty good, Noble. It's going pretty good. Is it in the correct mug, Noble? Too easy. Target destroyed. Very good. Alright, let's so we'll move her up a little bit. Right, we've got three points. So I need Riley to. I reckon half and destroy that. Riley destroy that. Let's do Riley first. Here I go. We do from here. What the? Really, it takes two to kill the pillbox. Man, that sucks. It just doesn't know how many it takes to kill on that. I guess if it doesn't go inside. I don't know, it's kind of awkward, isn't it? He did. Enemy spotted. Like gunpowder. Let's wipe them out. There we go. bit behind it goes inside. I guess it it takes a couple of curl. That's fine. Leave it to me. We'll do it we'll do it this way this turn. This way this turn. Take this. There we go. The pillbox is a nuisance, so getting rid of that's useful. One more for me. Right. And then I think what we'll do to fight and finish off. We will. There they are! Ah, uh, yeah, him. Wido. Yeah, it's safe for that one. Good. That should make things a little easier. Okay, let's try that. This shouldn't matter too much. Do you, think, do you think he was going to miss at that one? This is actually really good, he's wasting two turns shooting the cactus, which literally doesn't matter. Excuse me. Yeah, the cactus is great, isn't it? Keep going. He's crawling, he's like, fuck. Alright. Yeah, cactus, do, basically, a lot of the time you just take the cactus and go, meep, meep. I mean, we could easily go, we're gonna take the cactus and go up here. The anti tank cannon's a problem. 
Uh, I don't know what the range is of that. I don't know if it can do here. If it can't, we just go up this way. And then we go this way. Take these out. That's probably the best way to do it, is we, we drive up and deal with that. I, I don't even know if we need to capture all of them, or just capture the final one in this mission. I don't know how much this one matters at all. Uh, what are we going to do here? We can kill the tank in... We can kill each tank in one go. We, we kill this one first, then kill this one. We've got an anti-tank cannon up here, so I guess we need to move the half and around here-ish. Probably. We can take Godwin and go round. I need to... Advancing. Let's do this. I will see this through. Behind. They might be soldiers after all. Enemy sighted. Cool. Decent place to park. Okay, moving out. It does capture them, but like not all of them spawn dudes. I don't think that one over there has actually got anyone waiting, so I don't think it matters too much. Incoming! Miles, there's another one. What's that? Uh oh. I've never seen that kind of tank before. Is it a prototype or something? We'll intercept that. Rotate the turret. Fire! Eek. That was a direct hit! How dense is that plating? It's not just the plating. It's weapons and mobility are way beyond... It's the Vance, the it's the Vance Wars Mega Tank. Yeah, it's got like... Uh... What's that really stupid one in Advance Wars? There's the Neo Tank, and then there's the, the... Is it the Mega Tank, the one with, like, the three layers and the super turrets? We don't have the firepower to take it on. HQ, come in. This is Claude Wallace from Squad E. There's a new tank on the field, and it's a beast. We need more of our tanks here now. Watch out! They're on to you! Hello. Commencing counterattack. Follow my lead. There they are. Keep... All right. Cool. There's the. So we got. We should have cover from that, right? Let's have a think. What we want to do then? We need to capture this one. So. Let's take okay. Ferrier around here. Quickly obliterate this guy. Don't look at me. Brap. Enemy down. They're good. Magnificent. Really good. Damn it, we're being pushed back. Watch out for counterattack. There we go. Right then. So what we want to do now is we want to get up here and deal with these. Riley can deal with these relatively easily. I think. What do we want to do? Take Godwin. Godwin can easily make the push around here in one, if not two turns. This guy is a bit of an issue. We could probably get Kai over onto the tower if we take this out. I got this. I don't know how necessary this is, but. Keep calm and move onward. I'll help you. New tank is the ball-looking one. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Fault. It's like the squidgy ball-looking one. <laughs> Hell yeah! This base is mine. What we can do actually is use the cactus, go pick up Kai, bring her up here. That actually might be a better idea. And then pick Raz up later on the way. Are we winning? Mm, not sure yet. This is going to be an interesting yeah, yeah. Come on, get some honor. 
This is what the cactus is great for, doing something like this. Alright. Okay then. What have we got up here? So, what can we kill in one go? That's three. That's three. Tanks. Grenadier. Yeah, we need to get rid of the grenadiers, probably. Realistically. Oh, good shot. Good shot. Alright, so we got one more grenadier to work. There's two actually, there's one here. Ah, oh, see the other one I can see. No, there's two. Two. So I can probably use Kai a little bit more to clean up shop if we need to. So we got the one here, which is a problem. No, that's a scoot. Uh, there? There he is. Oh, nice shot. Hit him so hard he flew. And we got one more shot as well. I think if we get rid of those. Maybe we only need to get those two this turn because that one's so far back. And now we want to get rid of this guy. So, and we want to get Riley into position to deal with these two. What are we going to do here, I wonder? No, look, I have a choice. I don't know how far we can get round. This guy's gonna be in the bushes and shoot us probably. Watch out for counter attack. I don't know if it will kill him or not. We'll flush him out at least. Cool. They're firing on us. Now, look, I have a choice. I could possibly kill him before something like Nice. No sweat. I like Goblin. Nice. Keep right. up the good work. And then if we can... We should... Oh, are we gonna make it? Come on, we can make I it. The very best yes! Any thoughts on Microsoft turning off people's Xbox to fight climate change? Really? I didn't know anything about that. That's interesting. I I don't think it's Microsoft's uh, decision. I think once you've bought the console, it's kind of up to you what you do with it, really. I don't think they should be touching it. Now, the interesting thing here is I'm going to make a quick save here. Uh, I'll nick one of these. Okay. Yeah, Avengers being dead is kind of sad. It's not the best game in the world, but it's, you know, it's... That is still a shame. I, I enjoyed Marvel's Avengers for what it was. Enemy spotted. Let's wipe them out. How many hot are left? Oh, damn. Check. I'm kind of tempted to reload that and see if we can get the one shot. I think I think the one shot's going to be relatively important here, truthfully. Leave it to me. Alright. I think we really, really got to kill that. The Gatling's less important, I think. It's that anti-tank one we got to deal with. Take this. Really? All right. Let's see how this plays out. I feel that should be that should be a one shot, really. But we'll see. Okay. 
He's trying to shoot Godwin, that's kind of funny. When Riley gets more accurate, she can do some uh, interesting shots with these, with the mortars. It can actually end up slowing the tanks. Ooh, shit. That's bad. That's GG. Okay. Come on, move. Sorry, everyone. Okay, we actually have to move the half end on that turn then. Okay. Or alternatively. Alternatively, what we have to do is repair the tank. Could repair the tank, I guess. Try not to get killed. If we can get to it. Watch out for counterattack. Thank you. Engaging. Gotta stay calm. Alright, let's try that instead. Godwin's icon does look a little bit like a booba. Mike's not disabling the suspend mode quick option on Xboxes, so I have to do a full boot. Doesn't seem terrible, but I still think the choice. As long as the choice is there, if you want to do that or not, I guess. So this time we should survive the two shots. We can keep Nasty. going. I always hard turn off my consoles. I always hard turn off my consoles. It's just habit. But so I didn't I got no stake in this particular. Yeah, during the enemy's turn they they speed up the enemies because in the first game you had you waited a long time. Yay! Good. Just in the nick of time. It's an honor to fight on the same battlefield as Squad E. Don't fuck it up now. We're under your command now. Awaiting orders, sir. Roger that. Just what we needed. Now we can fight on our terms. Feder so we got some uh, Federation tanks here. Interesting. So to deal with these assault tanks, I guess. Alright, let's have a look around, shall we? We're gonna need to deal with these. Uh, first and foremost. I don't know how we're gonna get these without with Riley, but that's gonna be tricky, I think. Riley should be able to one-shot this thing, and I don't quite know what the problem is with her doing that is. Like the fast forward and turn cycle. Yeah, exactly, yeah. We exactly. Alright, we've got to get rid of this fucking thing. So let's let's tr It says it should be dead in one turn. So I need to work out there, let's try that. That was that was worse. Impressive. It's not usually so spotty. Uh, it's a learning experience. Mm, okay. Come on. Oh, Jesus Christ. We just can't kill this thing. We can't spend three command points killing this. We just can't. How, I'm gonna test like, to me. How much damage can Godwin do? How much damage can he do? Not a huge amount. Is the answer. Five. I don't know. Maybe Goldwyn could actually do this. I like that. I reckon Goldwyn could actually do it in five shots. Right on. Okay. With that, with That's not with that knowledge, we can potentially do something a bit different then. 
we're actually going a little bit kind of bit late. Uh, we'll try that. We'll try this and see what happens. Yeah, she's like, it's a learning experience. I'm like, I don't think it is. I think it's interesting. I think this mission is actually a lot more difficult than, like, say, the Cloden Wildwood, which is the same mission in um, VC1. This is definitely trickier. Definitely trickier. Thank you. Alright. Meet me, so we get to watch them miss again. I, I do love that you're trying to shoot Godwin, I can respect that. Godwin was not taking any chance though, he just shoved his head in the sandbag instead. A climatic, I mean this is the final fight, as, as they keep telling us. We win this and we push them all the way back to um, St. Petersburg. <laughs> no big deal. No big deal. No big deal, baby. Bot, incoming transmission from an allied tank. You don't understand climate nonsense. I live on the board. I mean, I, I don't know that 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 one, dude. I'm gonna disagree with you on like some basic research on the internet will pretty much tell you that. Like, it's not it's not super hard to educate yourself on various topics. Uh, I, you don't need me to lecture you on stuff. Have a quick look. It's a uh, it's a pretty quick and easy one. Lieutenant Wallace. Like whether they should do that with the consoles, I'll you know I'll agree on that one. But it's not it's not difficult to look basic stuff up. Good. It's an we're under. Roger. Right. Right, this turn then. I'm gonna try Goblin. Don't talk down to me! I'm not talking down to you, man. I think you're pretty cool. That's why I'm bringing you here. Alright. Let's see. Five. Yeah, so we get. This is way more accurate. Out of my way. Beautiful. Beautiful. No sweat. Now that makes life easier, doesn't it? Alright. Also, we can get this bunker over there. Cool. Right then, we've got one more over here that we need to deal with, don't we? We've got this assault tank over here. I don't know if the, the tank can actually do much to the cactus, interestingly. Like, as the cactus, we could just go pick up Raz, drive past, give zero shits, kill this one, kill this one, kill this one with Raz. I need Riley to kill that Grenadier as well. Not Riley, a Kai. At the back, I should be able to get him, I want to say. Halfen can... Halfen can probably deal with a few of these, but we can't have that up there, so we need to do this first. Okay. Let's see what we can do with Cactus. Yeah, I'm on. Let's see what we can do with Cactus. Proven, bro. I'm not gonna argue with about it, man. Like, go look, go look it up or don't. I, I, I'm gonna be truthful with you. I don't care. I really don't. I'm, I'm playing, I'm playing anime war games. So I'm not interested in whether you believe polar bears should be swimming or sitting on glaciers. Frankly. Right. Let's. Do I bother with this camp? I don't think I do. I think I probably take these guys around. This is a tricky one. That this is this is legitimately a tricky one. Yep, I'm on it. I think. I think we do take cactus one further up. Okay, not bad, not bad. We can. What can we do here? Thirty-one to kill the Gatlin turtle. Well, that ain't gonna fucking happen, is it? Is that anything we can do here? Looks like it. It's a shame you can't actually dis like dis disembord them, I guess. But uh, 
Cool. That's a little bit of extra damage. Right, so I guess we take Raz and we'll clean up shop. Is what we need to do. I've got this. Where's that bomb? I did see it. We good? We good. Oh no, we're not good. We're not good, that's bad. Okay, where's the anti-tank one? There. Anti-tango Easy. Done and done. Okay, and we do have the improvised pillbox as well. I'm just gonna park myself here. Okay. I think we can use these other tanks now. I don't know how far they go or how burly they are. I guess let's test it. Let's test it. They're pretty sluggish. That's one. We've got nothing else anti-tank to worry about. We do have these assault tanks, which are... There's three of them here we have to get rid of, I think, this turn. I just fucking say. Watch out. Watch out for counter attack. Okay. Nice. So we're now out of ammo. So I could take half and take out the other two. And then I think we're golden. We've got this one here, which could be an issue. I could heal Harfen and not worry about it, I guess. Or we could play Risky. Let's play Risky. Let's play Risky. Keep calm and move onward. Commencing counterattack. Follow my lead. Watch out for counterattack. Watch out! They're on to you! Okay. Keep calm and move onward. Nice. That powers all the tanks. Is that a big technological advancement? Yes. Ragnite. It's like a magic ore, I guess, for lack of a better term. It gives ginormous amounts of power. We need to get an actual unit up here, is the, is the, is the spooky bit. I don't know who we're going to get up here to capture this. Because there ain't going to be any of these poops. I could actually use Rebecca. Rebecca's not quite a scout, but she's pretty close. The other option is take the cactus back round with Nico in it. Oh, Nico! I could take I could take Nico back round easy. Actually, next turn. Hell, I could take Nico around this turn. Maybe. Okay, moving out. See this through. Okay. Watch out for counter attack. Keep calm and look. Nice. Okay, perfect. We could use the last one, or we could do that next turn actually, potentially, but. I, I need to get either a back I need to get one of these peeps through here. Godwin would be good, but there's no way down, unfortunately. The best bet is to take Nico, drive her around like this to like here, let Nico out, and in two turns capture on turn four. That's what I think is going to be the best way to do this. Uh, other options, I take half and one more time and perch it right at the fucking end. That's the other option. I think we'll do that. Push him back. I think we'll take half as far as we go.
There we go. I think we do this. That's, that is the best thing that could have happened. That is the best move that tank could have made. Lol. That can't do anything to the characters. Kitty cat came to you, sat in laps and mama, I need four kiss. Aw, kitty. I hope you uh, petted your lovely cat. Uh oh, that's more of a problem. Oh god, win. I've got a few turns, I've got a few yes, turns. It's time to play the piper. I, no one, he, he'll be fine. I just need to um, finish this mission quickly. Okay. Yep, I'm on it. Okay. Commencing counterattack. Follow my lead. You know, just as I can. Here it comes. Nice shot. Watch out! They're on to you! They're coming! Okay. So what we're gonna do is yeah, yeah. We've definitely got this. We've definitely got this. Watch out for counterattacks. Uh-oh! The enemy's firing back! Sorry, Raz. He's fine. No. Don't worry about it. Keep right. What we want to do now then is take half and destroy the shock trooper. Advancing. This is gonna be a bit of a weird one. I'm gonna take I'm gonna take cactus a little bit further. There we go. I'll do my best. Shit. We captured the beast. There we go. Four turns. That wasn't bad. Tough tough mission actually. Forgot how difficult that was. Soldiers too. What? No one got hurt. Pressing on would be ah, dangerous. That's fine. Good point. What should we do? Let's retreat. The rear guard can hold the line, but we tend to our wounded and resupply. Whoa, hey, are you serious? After we came all this way? We can't capture the fortress on our own, can we? Let's trust our allies and pull back for now. A rank, yeah, I thought as much. Nice. Cool. Squad stories. There we go. Squad stories are sub-episodes that focus on your daily lives of your various squad mates. New stories appear after certain units are deployed enough. Try pairing soldiers like each other. Keep in mind that dead soldiers should not be deployed in, in, deployed in squad stories. You certainly impressed someone in that last battle. Nice. Got some new weapons. Cool. I'll have to look at that. Let's have a look. Uh, squad stories. Treading new ground. Oh, in this case, it's uh, for Dan, Miles, and the engineer we've never used. Interesting. I just want to make sure before I save, I didn't actually have anyone dead. I don't think I did, but. Okay. The fresh. Yeah, he's fine. Goblin's alright. Cool. Normally, if you finish a mission um, with them there, it's fine, so. That's cool. Good stuff. There. All set for the next. Alrighty. I'm gonna stop here.
So thank you ever so much, everyone, for watching. I hope you enjoyed. This has been this has been tough missions actually today. We've had to do some uh, some interesting plays to uh, not get horribly brutalized. So I hope everyone's had a lovely, lovely time. And I will see y'all tomorrow with any luck. Uh, Dead, don't forget, Dead Space Friday. So for those who want to see the new Dead Space, we're doing it Friday. Once again, Noble, have a very, very happy, happy birthday. And Owl as well, wasn't it? Wasn't it your mum? I hope she has a birthday, and a very nice birthday as well. Take care, everyone. Love a lot of you, and I hope to see you all again very, very soon. Mwah.